What is up guys, welcome back to another player review. We are going to be looking at the World Cup winner and that is Goethe. He is going for over 2 million coins. Can you guys believe that shit? 2 million coins and it's because he just scored the final goal in the World Cup and got Germany to win the whole thing. Is that worth it? Fuck yeah. Anyway, if you guys are looking for a cheap, reliable place to get your coins, check out battlelay.com. The link will be in the description. Then use the code ETONY to get 5% off. If you're looking for PSN cards, Microsoft points, or cheap games, check out G2A. Their link will also be in the description. And let's begin. To begin with, this guy came out as a striker, not a left winger, not a right winger. It's a fucking striker, man. And he has really good pace to begin with. 84 pace or anything like that. It doesn't matter. He feels exactly like what his pace stats on the card say. And now, very good dribble. Very good finisher for a striker, 4 star skills and 4 star weak foot and also his heading is surprisingly not bad. I scored a couple of headers with him surprisingly so you could definitely score headers just don't expect him to be an aerial threat each time. I could have been lucky and scored the headers with him but he seems to be not bad at scoring headers. He seems like just like another Aguero where Aguero is short but still manages to score headers. Now he has decent finesse shots, I think, think his finesse shots were amazing but that could be down to his shot power it isn't that great now his shooting is very inconsistent it is in the middle so at the at the end of the video you're gonna see it. it's in the yellow not a red not a green but it's in the yellow because it is inconsistent sometimes you will feel his shot is very powerful then it hits the post it hits the crossbar it makes the goalkeeper work and a lot of the time you will feel that what the hell the goalkeeper is saving every shot even when you're through onto goal the goalkeeper might save it because his shot power just isn't up there now he has amazing passing he set up my Aubameyang so many times it's unbelievable so you will see it in this video as well and positioning I had no problems with his positioning I thought it was really awesome so free kick I actually scored a really nice free kick against Czech I think it was and I really enjoyed uh, I really enjoy scoring free kicks with players because it's so hard to get a free kick in FIFA 4 and it's so hard to score it uh, compared to the previous FIFAs. Now he is very weak, this is the only negative I had about him other than his shooting is inconsistent which is in the yellow but the pure negative thing about him is his weakness, I mean well his strength. So he is very weak, every, every time a defender comes up to him he will take the ball off him but there is a little clip at the end where he fucking takes Sergio Ramos out and he goes on to score the score the goal. This will be because he has awesome agility and awesome balance at the same time. Now, if I had to rate him, um, I would have to say he is better than Muller. I'm going to have to say this. He is better than Muller in the striker position and also he is better than Muller in a center attack in mid position. I just prefer Goetze. I'm not too sure why. He just seems a lot better and more fluid and more in position when I need him. So, um, is he worth 2 million coins? Fuck no, he is nowhere near worth that much, but he is a good player. And as you guys know, we do not take price into consideration because we don't know what they're going to settle at. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, I'd really appreciate a like. Let me know who do you prefer in your team, Muller or Goetze. Hope you guys enjoyed it and hope you guys have a very nice day.